Hi team, this is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. Welcome to the Go STEM series. This is a series of videos designed to help science teachers prepare for the new science exams that are coming out in 2020 and 2021. It's really important when you're getting ready for these new exams to know your content. So we're gonna look at some of that content on these exams through these videos. Now these are some of the exams that are out there, but I wanna focus in on the science ones for a moment. You're gonna notice that the MTEL 10, MTEL 11, MTEL 12, 13, 14, 33. These are all your science exams for middle school and high school teachers. They're all being revamped. But the one thing that's not happening, even though you're gonna get different questions, is that the core content on all these exams is gonna stay the same. They're not coming up with a new formula for photosynthesis and cellular respiration. Some things will not change. The content piece will not change. So it's really important if you're getting ready to take one of these exams or any of the content exams, whether it's science, history, or English, or reading, whatever it is, focus on the content piece, or more specifically, the content vocabulary on your exam. There's lots of content vocabulary for science. This is just a small list that Go Academy put together a few years ago. These, these, these vocabulary words aren't gonna change. But you notice it's a long list. It keeps going. When you're studying these terms on the pre-workshop homework and the packet, the, the workshop packet, make sure you prioritize the terms. These terms here would be the ones that you definitely would want to spend a little bit of time on. These are, these are ones for all the exams that are fair game on all the exams, like the scientific method, natural phenomena, reliability, validity. Every single science exam is going to have these. Okay, you're taking the general science exam or the biology exam, cellular respiration, and photosynthesis. Of course, these are core, core ideas. Now, when you get to other vocabulary words that are more specific to your specific exam, like biology, chemistry, physics, engineering, well, obviously, your exam is going to have more specific things. But, but make sure, team, when you're starting out, make sure, team, that you start with the core stuff. Everyone should start with the core ideas first. And then with your own exam, you build out. Hi team, this is Chris Abraham from Go Academy. If you like this video, press the like button below or subscribe to our channel. This allows us to do more videos for teachers on their teacher certification exams. And if you need additional help, you can come and check out a Go Academy workshop or webinar or tutoring. You go to www.goacademy.com. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.